Hello and welcome to Saki Tech. In today's video, I will show you guys how to convert your HTC One M8 to the Google Play edition of the HTC One M8. Now this ROM is based off of the latest and purest form of Android straight from Google. But this conversion will not allow for OTA updates. Anyway, here are the requirements for this procedure. Number one, you must have an unlocked bootloader on your M8. Number two, you must have a custom recovery installed such as TWRP or Clockwork Mod Recovery on your M8 and your M8 can be rooted but this is not a requirement. So before you race ahead go and watch my crystal clear step by step how to root your HTC One M8 video which takes care of all the three requirements mentioned above. There is a link in the description below. Once you meet all the requirements this procedure is easy as pie. Now before we proceed further, a big warning, watch my backup and restore video if you wish to create a full system backup before you proceed. A full system backup will back up everything in your phone and I mean everything from music, videos, pictures, text messages, apps, app settings, phone call logs, etc. Including your entire operating system. So if anything goes wrong, you can restore your phone to the way it was before you attempted to install a new ROM. Now the very first step is to go to my website post for which I left a link in the description below and uh, download the Google Play Edition ROM. So if you go to my website at the bottom here it says required files to download. Okay under that just click this grab HTC One M8 Google Play Edition which is going to take you to this website XDA developers. Scroll down remain on the first post and it says right here it says a link and a mirror you can go to either one of these guys to download the file so if you go to the link all you do is you wait seven seconds let me just show you real quick it's gonna search for some mirrors and then once you're ready you just tap one of these guys and your download shall start right away okay so the download is complete and it's right here the next step is to connect your HTC One MA to your PC using a micro USB cable and then make sure that you can actually see your phone make sure it's just turned on regularly okay so you're gonna be seeing it under your portable devices or your storage devices go inside to the internal storage of your phone grab this file the ROM that we downloaded and just drag it to the internal storage right here okay after the transfer is over you can detach your phone from your PC and let me switch over to my HTC One M8 and I'm gonna show you what to do next to get this process completed alright so switching over to our phone the first thing I want you to do is go to the settings go all the way down go to battery manager and disable fast boot at the bottom alrighty make sure it's unchecked and then turn off your phone perfect next we want to go into the custom recovery of our phone so press the volume down and power buttons on your phone at the same time this is going to take you into the boot loader mode now from here using the volume down key select recovery and then press power button to go into the recovery and that is going to take us to the TWRP or if you have clockwork mod recovery that's where you're going to go now anytime before you install a brand new ROM you have to wipe your existing ROM so everything has to be deleted so the first step is to go to the wipe option on the top and then the next thing is to do a factory reset if you look at that factory reset carefully it says it's going to wipe the data the cache and the Delvic cache and that is exactly what we need so what we're gonna do is we're just gonna swipe to factory reset the phone at the bottom so swipe it and this is a very fast procedure it's gonna be done instantaneously once it's done just tap that back button go back one more time and the next step is to go to install okay and tap that storage button on the top before you do anything 
and make sure you select internal storage then press OK to choose and then scroll all the way down and this is where we move the GPE4.zip file from our desktop to the internal storage of our HTC One. Tap it and simply swipe to confirm flash and that is going to start the installation procedure. Let me fast forward this to the end and see what it looks like. Alright so the procedure is complete you get the successful message right there and the next step is to actually reboot your system to your freshly installed operating system. Now once you reboot it's actually going to start off with the Google Play edition of the ROM. Okay so let's uh, let's wait for this to reset real quick. Reboot I mean. So there's the HTC logo but watch this. It goes into Google Play Edition. So it's going to take the first time, it's going to take a couple minutes for the setup to complete. Let me again fast forward this to the main setup screen that you guys will see as well. All right, so let's uh, do the initial setup. Press next. Just skip everything. We're going to go straight into the phone and see what it looks like. Skip. Skip anyway. No. Not now. Next. Just give it some name. DND. Okay. Next. And there we go. Just click OK to everything. OK. And that's our uh, HTC One with Google Play Edition running the latest form of Android. So go down about phone and as you can see it says Android version 4.4.2 KitKat. Alright. Alright so that brings us to the end of this video. Uh, go ahead and subscribe to my channel for more videos to come. Uh, give me a thumbs up if you liked this video and also you can go ahead and connect with me socially on Google+, Facebook and Twitter for which all the links are in the description below. Thank you again, and I'll see you the next time. And if you have any questions, comments, concerns, just throw them down in the comments section below.